Assalamu alaikum, my name is Nida Ahmed. I graduated from Zaytuna College in 2019 and I'm currently a first year medical school student at UT Southwestern in Dallas, Texas. And so I just wanted to share a few thoughts with you about my time at Zaytuna. One of the things I really took away was this idea that all knowledge is connected. At the start of every class, we would go through what are called the Mabadi al Ashara, or the 10 foundational principles of every science. And one of those principles is the science's relationship to other sciences. So before I came to Zaytuna, I thought subjects like metaphysics and logic had absolutely nothing to do with medicine. But if we look at the great Muslim physicians of the past, like Ibn Sina, we see that they had this robust metaphysical framework that was philosophically and logically sound, and it was based upon the principles of Islam, and then upon that they built their medical theories and practices. And so, for example, so, uh, questions like what is the human being, what are valid sources of knowledge, medicine itself can't answer these questions, but medicine certainly relies upon those answers. So now that I'm in, I'm in medical school, whenever I'm presented with knowledge, I think to myself, what are the assumptions being made? What are the first principles? And do I agree with them? Are they in line with Islamic beliefs? And so Zaytuna really taught me to be critical about these kinds of things. And aside from the academic aspects, um, Zaytuna is also a very God-centric institution. It really made me think about the things I'm saying, the things I'm doing and studying. Are they things that are pleasing to God? I recently read an article that a pharmaceutical company was manipulating its data to make these very dangerous psychotropic drugs approved for use in children. And my education at Zaytuna really made me sensitive about things like this and has really shaped the way that I want to pursue medicine. And I just find that to be such an invaluable thing that an education could give me. And so truly, I just want to take this moment to express my sincere gratitude to all of my teachers at the school, to all of my peers, and all of the supporters at the college who have supported me and all of the students through their prayers and contributions. I pray that Allah always bless Zaytuna College and help it to grow and succeed, and to bless all of its supporters with the best in this life and in the next. Assalamu alaikum.